Today is Kickstarter Rewards Day, and I'm so excited. I got in a Kickstarter for the Divine Diversity deck. If you want to take a look at this deck and see an unboxing, stick around. There is nothing more fun than when a Kickstarter gets fulfilled and I ain't getting my decks and I'm super excited. Today, this is from uh, the Divine Diversity deck from Joe Phillips. I literally, it came while I was just shooting my Phantom decks. So I'm gonna try to get that one out first because I've been trying to shoot that for weeks and then get to this one out too. But this one might go out first because it might be a little quicker to edit. Cause it's so uh, basically, brown box, right? I did go and take the tape off of it so it'll be a little bit easier to open. I did back the double deck set because I was just, you know, if you're gonna, if you're gonna give me two decks, you know, it was like ten dollars to add the second deck, and I'm like, um, yes, please. So, so I'm I'm obviously just gonna open one, but here but here are the decks. Divine diversity. This is by Joe Phillips. This is the second edition. Uh, I'm like so. I've got two decks. Go special kicks, special thanks to the Kickstarter community. Without you, we can't do it. Or made in China because you know that's where texts come from now. So this just looks really, really cool. So we're gonna take a quick open it here. This deck was uh, fulfilled pretty quickly, so I'm happy about that. Classic. I should have. I don't know if you can see the embossing on it, um, which just it's just great. This should be, I thought this is a magnetic wraparound box, but it's clearly not. It's two piece. And it is a tight fit. I get it, I get it, I get it. Oh, okay, there we go. Cool. Inside the box. Here are the backs. Uh, it does have a little guidebook. Very little. By the way, I have meaning in there. Some of them. It looks like the uh, the trumps are a little bit bigger, but the minors are a little bit light. Whatever. <laughs> I'm not saying I might have just bought this for this amazing metallic purple uh, gilding. Mm, but it didn't hurt. It didn't hurt. Okay, love sleeve. This deck is nice and chunky. Oh, that's cold. Cool. So, we'll go. Go. We're gonna take a quick look at this. Let me zoom in so I can get a better view of the cards. Get that out of the way. Okay, here we go. So the fool, the magician. Oh, that's awesome. These are a little bit of a matte cardstock. Um, fairly, fairly firm. High Priestess with a cat, which oh, this Empress is great. Emperor, Hierophant. This is kind of meant to be a deck filled with diversity, but I am going to have a feeling it's going to be a little body beautiful. Oh yeah, it has multiple lovers cards. I remember that being a deal, which is great for. Variety. Chariot. The cards feel like they've got a little bit of a bend. Bend back to them. But um I did literally I literally just grabbed this out of the mall box. Um and it's been cold today. So I might be the the temperature effect. A sexy hermit. Man. Wheel of Fortune. How fierce is this justice card? She's great. The Hangman. Oh, I love this death. Oh, with the Raven mask. Oh, that is just, that is so cool. Temperance. Devil. I think there's supposed to be multiple devils. Yeah. So. Tower. Star, Moon, 
sun, judgment, and the world. Great. Okay, get going to the cups. Ace, two, three. Oh, I like the little water switch on top. Four cups. Five. Six. Little Iron Wright Smith there. Seven of cups. Eight. Yep. Moving on. <laughs> I love a fat and happy nine of cups card. I just do. Ten of cups. Happy family. Page of cups. Knight. Queen. And king. Cards aren't sticking together. I thought they might because of the gilding. Sometimes the gilding will stick together. King. And next to pentacles. Ooh, that is such a cool looking card. Two of pentacles. Earth base because got the mountains. Three of Pentacles. Four. Five Pentacles. Inside the church, huh? That's really interesting. Not the same person. Okay. I like the detail, like in the in the in the street with the tiles. That's really cool. Seven of Pentacles. Eight, yep. Nine of Pentacles. Gorgeous. Ten of Pentacles, yep. That's a that's a family card too. Love those dogs. Page of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. Queen and King. I like the perspective here. Looking at looking up at the King. It's, it's good. It's cool. Ace of Swords. Two of Swords. I like it. I like the I like the um not the straight on but the angle here. Three of Swords. Three swords to a heart. Can't get away from it sometimes. Oh. This almost seems more of a five of swords card than a four of swords, but yeah. After the battle, time to retreat and recover. That's five. I mean, that's clearly a five of swords. Like the air. Six. Oh, that is a great seven of swords. That might be a little over dramatic on the eight of swords. <laughs> Sometimes eight of swords can be a little over dramatic, but I, maybe I like it. Nine of swords. Oh, that's rough. That's seven of swords. I was, I was talking about, was it the. Uh, the Hello Kitty tarot, where they're stabbed in the front. Let's... Page of Swords. Knight of Swords. Love that energy. Queen of Swords. King of Swords. I think I would have liked to see more knights as women in this deck. Just because. Ace of Wands. Two of Wands. Three of Wands. ones I like this I like the idea of the building of the of the canopy for the event so yeah this is this is my favorite kind of five of ones where you have these the competition and the play going on six of ones seven of ones eight now that's really interesting the idea of throwing the wands. Nine of 
wand. Yep. Ten of wands. Page. Knight. Queen. Ah, oh, she is fierce too. And key. There we go. Let's see. It's, it's kind of a chunky deck. I wonder how it's going to shuffle. I wonder how it's going to shuffle. This might be tough on the microphone too, by the way. Oh, it doesn't budge very well. It is stiff. It is a stiff deck. Two. I got it. So this will be fun. Let's look at the cards right now. Of course, barely shuffled, obviously. I don't think I hate the black borders. Yeah, these, these are barely shuffled. Yeah, I think I think this will this will be a fun little deck. Oh, let me zoom out so it's a little bit better. Yeah, I think I need to make a choice about the lovers cards too. So there we go. So that's the Divine Diversity deck by Joe Phillips. A quick little walkthrough. Thanks for being here. I'll see you next time.